What's up, peeps? It's Shanna Cassandra here, and we're back with more Mist Exile. Ooh. The Exiled. So last time we picked up a book. Um, yes, we haven't read it. That's not creepy. That's not creepy at all. Someone's a little obsessed with someone. I think it might be his wife. Uh, sure. Or could it be Catherine? Uh, no. She has much darker hair. Yeah, but I mean, he's working with mud. There's dark mud! <laughs> Trust me, I know my mud. And there yeah. is dark mud. <laughs> Anywho, we haven't read the book we picked up because it was long. But it does contain hints for different, um... Hello. Let's see. This is a hint. This yes. one is a hint. I know that. It is. There are... things. Marbles. Oh, glass balls. They're really pretty. Yeah. Um, let's see. Ink, perhaps? I think so. And things to make ink, perhaps? Maybe. <laughs> or to make poisons, or, or, or. This will just take me to say spot. Okay. Yeah. So it looks like that thing is a balance for those things, so one of those things equals a bunch of those things. Let's see how many. Four. Four. We have the gear, the metal. I think if you wind it, it makes electricity. Yes, I will touch it in a second. Oh, yeah! Interesting. I know what this is a hint for. Like a plant that makes electricity? Yep. No, no, it's not a plant that makes electricity. It's okay, a plant. What can I just uh, yeah, you want. Uh, oh, well, test it first. See what it does, because it's really cool. Oh, here it is. I want, I want to know, are those little, like, magnetic rockies, or just... Hmm. And now, if you move that, that's a plant. There's a fly. I feel really bad for this plant. <laughs> well, <laughs> I love how the fly's kind of like, FREEDOM! And then, no, never mind. <laughs> it's like that guy from, um, Hunchback of Notre Dame. Oh, okay. I'm free! I'm free! Dang it! I've only seen, I, you, I think I've only seen that movie once. I thought I could get closer to this. It's like, he's, he's going to be mur he's going to be killed or something, and he gets free, and then he ends up getting stuck in the stockades, mm -hmm. and then he gets free again, and he oh, ends yeah. up getting stuck in, he, he falls into the sewers, basically. <laughs> More ink. Blowy things. Looks like stones. More balancing stuff. So, if one of those things equals four of the other... I think these are a different kind of material, though. Mm. These are wood. I think the other thing was like some Metal. kind of, like, Nara or something. It's just rocking. Rocking. Yeah. This tells me nothing. Nope. Can you see the other basket? Let's see. So one of those things it's equals four, four wood. wood. So the woods are the lightest. Yes. The glass are the second lightest, and the metal are the heaviest. Yeah. Whatever they are. <laughs> Good thing it doesn't matter that we actually know what it's made of or anything. Can you imagine if that was like stuff? Where it's like you it. need to know what it's called. You know, you need to know its composition. I think I I'd, I'd go mad. Was there something back there with that doorway? And there was a like, I tried people. going to it, but it wouldn't let me. Can you go around it? It looks like there's a walkway. Yeah. Mm. There we go, finally. Ooh! Okay. Elevator? Yes? Yes. Alright. Huh. Okay. This is not... This is gonna go so well. I... Ugh. I don't remember if you can die at this point or not. 
Oh, well, we're gonna find out. <laughs> we're gonna learn today. <laughs> uh, behind you. To your right. Oh, yes, here it is. Wait, are there three different... Oh, okay, no, I get it. I get it. I thought there were, like, different ones and you'd have to enter a combination. Well, it was kind of... It's a tiny one and then the bigger one. It's a good thing we're not afraid of heights. Yeah. Or death. Where'd he go? I feel like this is where, there he is. Oh no. This is the one that freaked me out. This is the exact scene. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I wasn't you? expecting it. Uh, Come to rescue your book so soon? We must look like Atreus or something. Not yet. Must be. Friend. Or, he, I, I think maybe he hasn't seen Asterisk in like 20 years, I think is the deal. But we were standing in the office with the guy, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but also it's a tiny peephole. Yeah. And he's all the way over there. What are you doing? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, oh, he's taking a little pod and he's leaving. Okay. We're, and we're just watching because, you know. Great. Yeah, right. actually, I feel like this might have freaked me out, too. I've always been scared of Severio. Like, I, he's... I've never actually... Okay, we can move now. I don't know that I've ever seen him done anything super crazy, <laughs> but I'm still like, oh my god, okay. he's gonna kill me! <laughs> I think it's because I've had so many bad, uh, like, experiences with Gen in Riven. Because in Riven, Gen kills you if you're not, like, paying attention. Oh, great. We can go outside. Alright. Well, can we, how do we unlock that? I think that's what the yeah. button was for. Well, we're gonna find out. I thought it might. It might put, put us back down. Put us back down, but. Whoops. Well, my bad. Okay. That's okay. That was like the only thing we could do. Yeah. The one thing about this part is it's like, I want to see through the people. Like, I want to watch through the porthole. I don't want to watch down, but they make you watch down. What if I just go back up? <laughs> or I press just this small lever? Nope, can't. Just both of them. You can't think independently like that. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't anticipate that. Uh, sorry, sorry, peeps. For being so <laughs> redundant right now. <laughs> well, elevators, man. I was gonna say, at least we're being elevated. You know? Um, we should put some of the elevator music in when we're going up. <laughs> I'm trying to think of like a. I don't know why I bothered. I was just hoping. Hoping he can soap. Is he still there? Are you, are you still there? Hey, buddy! No, it looks hey. like he's, he's left the building. No, he'll be back. I, I think he, oh. there he is. Oh, there he is. He's a busy man! Um, I find it a little weird that I can peep in on him. But it does speak to how confident he is. That he's not at all worried. He's like, oh, are you watching? That's nice. <laughs> you want to take notes, too? <laughs> Enjoying the show. Lips and shirt a little bit. It's like, no, 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 no. I've always wondered if it was actually like you, like you or I, we look very different from Atris, and to the point where it's like we are women. Yes. <laughs> yes. And he's just like, Atris, is that you? And I'm like, Stay, are you blind? <laughs> it's like, wow, you sound so womanly, Atris. What happened? He's nearsighted. Yeah, that's what I think it is. I think that must be the problem. It's probably also why it took him like I think I think it's supposed to be like twenty years or something. <laughs> it took him twenty years to do this. Yeah, because he was not super old when he had, when he had his boys, he had to be like 20 or 30 something. I feel like that's about a regular age for... Yeah, but okay, so here's the problem is the Denis don't age as quickly as humans. When he's the Denis? He, he's, um, he's a quarter Denis. Yeah. 
So Denis can age to like three, four hundred, and like live to three or four hundred years old. Mm-hmm. So I mean, he looks like he's probably forty, but he could be sixty. Mm-hmm. There's nothing out there. Uh, if you look down to your right, I feel we might have missed the thing because we didn't go that way. Yeah, okay. I don't know where it is. Somewhere around here is a thing. A flower. Yeah, you, with the cute little cutie, cutie, cutie. So you never beat this? I don't know. I think we did, but I don't know. Like I said, I played it when I was a child. Right. <laughs> Whistling Rock. Thank you for telling me this. I've never had that because I've never had the subtitles on. I guess it's because you can hear the the wind. It's interesting. I can. Oh! Oh no! It's can you click it? Okay. I don't know. Well, it's hard because we can't hear. So. I don't think anything would change if you click it. But we'll find out in post. <laughs> like, hey, remember that really important hint we missed <laughs> because we couldn't hear anything? Yeah, that's a thing. Is that just a... Yep. That's the thing with these games. It's like, you have to click everything just in case. Yeah. The only thing I remember from Riven, really, is, like, the lo- the creature that looked like Nessie. There's an Loch Ness... I, let's see, I remember this game better than I remember Riven. Well, that's because this came out more recently. Yeah. So. That would make sense. Yeah. I played this one, I think the last time I played it was either end of high school or in college. I think I'm going to go... I guess we'll go towards the ivory tower. Speaking of ivory towers, what is it about ivory towers that they're like equated to love? There's a thing with that. Love. Yeah, it's like there's a whole bunch there's of love, love songs that talk about the ivory ta- your ivory tower. What? And it's like, what? Maybe that's that an Irish thing, because... <laughs> no, 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 it's not from Irish songs, that's the thing. What songs are you hearing? Um, well, there's one from Take Me to the Pilot. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then there's a, there was a, it like... Fine. At first I thought it was just them doing it, and then it was like, I heard some other song, and I can't remember specifically what it was, but they mentioned an ivory tower, and I'm like, what is this thing? It's got to be a reference to something. Okay, they won't let me look through that or anything, so... Uh, what if you try the door? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. What? Is, does that, is that a peephole or is that a reflective thing? I think thing? that's a handle. Oh, really? It's a... What? It, I don't... I can't... I wish I could see, like, they do a close-up so I can see these puzzles properly. Yeah. <laughs> See, the last time I played this, I actually played it on a, um, a projected full screen. Like, mm. wide, wide, wide screen, so it was, like, Okay, so these massive. things kind of go in a little bit? Like, they're buttons? Oh, they're buttons! Do you have to find, like, the right order? Maybe. Check, check Atris's book. Or, not okay. Atris's, it might be Cerverio's. Okay, how do I do that? I don't remember. <laughs> Try select. Or maybe why. Oh, okay. It was why. Okay. Um I've returned, da 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 keep going. Seriously, so Anak and I are not in some every day. It'd probably be with a picture. Uh Wheels. some kind of what horseshoe thing. He needs to work on his drawing. Something with gears. I like Hattress's drawings better, they're easier to read. No, it cannot be true! Surely his journals deceive me! <laughs> okay, we're keeping moving on. Uh, I remember that one, but I think that's in the Tusk, so... Um, mm-hmm. That's later as well. Oh, wait! This is the Flux Capacitor! What? The Flux Capacitor from uh, Back to the Future. Is it? That looks exactly like the Flux Capacitor to me. <laughs> well, shit. Okay. <laughs> Crossover. <laughs> so is uh, yeah, Severio actually... Um, is Severio actually... What's his face? Oh, Doc. Marty? 
Or or Doc Brown. Ah, uh, he has Doc's hair. There might be something here. When did we get? When did we get his journal? I guess it's because I skipped over his stuff. He was probably like, mm -hmm. here, take this journal with you. <laughs> There's nothing. Keep going. Uh... Yeah, sorry guys, we missed an entire section because I just hit the button. I wasn't thinking. Old fool's memories. That's it? Okay. Ugh. Um, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's... Try to do a star pattern, starting in the bottom left. Okay. Bottom left, top. Oh, you're doing yours backwards. Okay. What? Do backwards stars. I was gonna if say... You said bottom left, so... Yeah, bottom left to top, to bottom, to right, uh, to left, to right. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely not having any effect. You never know. <laughs> you can kind of tell. All right. Fine. <laughs> Oops. Love the clouds too. They look so natural and cloud-like. Good job, graphic design people. Yeah. Good job. We're not patronizing. At least I'm not saying though anything <laughs> about the water. Okay. The clouds are nice. They, they look are. almost like just photo. I'm I'm actually wondering if they were done three D or if they're actually like just a matte painting, or if somebody just went out and took a panoramic of a shit ton of clouds and just put them in. It's not cheating. It's actually hard work to get a proper panoramic. So. I didn't say it was cheating. I know somebody's going to think <laughs> that I did, and think that I'm like being like, oh, they just took pictures and put them in. But that stuff's hard. Anyway, UV maps are great on this. Good job, guys. Interesting. What is that? What is that? It's like a pattern of almost like a snowflake. It type looks thing. like it's got to be a window. <gasps> There was something about seeing the window for the task. Remember the window has like an eye grate on it? I didn't go and look close up at it. I should have. <laughs> mm! What? I missed an entire thing. On the side of the rock for the tusk. There's a ladder on the other side that lets you go down and there's a whole bunch of levers to do the thing with the barrel to get the barrel to roll out of the way. Well, we can always head back. I don't know if you can do it before this one, though. What is that? It looks like a broken, like there should have been something there, but it's broken. Okay. Oh, crap. Are we missing one of the... Severio, you crafty bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's, that's the one thing I've always wondered is, is like, they have like, these puzzles and they're perfectly lined up. Why has nobody ever meddled with them? Alright. Well, that's the first part of the game anyways, really. It's more like just exploring and seeing what each puzzle is. Yeah. What is this? This is the, what the thing was looking at. What is but that, though? This probably turns something. Yeah. And that's... It turns that, I think. So what is that? Hmm. I think it has a light on it or something, maybe. No. Is the top part moving though? The... No. There, there's an opening. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I knew there was something about it. Yeah. There we go. Clever. Now what? That's. That. that and then that goes through the oh and then you have to link them all to go through the I eye of the tusk I figured that? it had to do something with light oops shit I didn't mean to turn it where are we supposed to direct it to oh my god you know what this is giving me flashbacks to Prince of Persia yes the best game in the world the best <laughs> game in the world with the shittiest puzzle <laughs> in the world <laughs> It was such a simple puzzle. It's so simple, but we did it right one time, and it was like, no, no, no. 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 <laughs> I think this might be the right way. But, but we're going to have to find out next time. All right. So. Oh, right in my eye. Ooh. Yeah, let's just blind the thing. <laughs> that's fine. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's let's look closer. 
Not a problem. Not a problem at all. It's headed towards that thing. I suspect. So, did I start it? Did I start Yeah, you did. Oh, you did. All right, yeah. then. So, uh, that's going to be it for this episode. And until next time, go out and play. Bye. Bye. Reading all of my journals. <laughs> it's kind of me. like we are right now. Uh, <laughs> you know, yeah, it's fine. It's good. The main character in that, Cole Phelps. Phelps. He was just walking up. Did you say Cole Phelps? <laughs> yeah, I did. Well done, well done. Perfect place to end it on. It's so pretty. <laughs> and it's like perfectly framed. You should be a photographer. You should Thanks. be a video game photographer. Thanks. <laughs>